Hello guys, Tom here, hope that you're doing okay. Today I'm going to show you how you can use Reaper to play back, let's say, 4 track or 5 track, and in the same time, using always Reaper, you can record your left and right from your desk. So let's say that you're doing a show and you have got playback, like 4 track or playback, and in the same time you want to record using USB. Okay, and I'm gonna show you how I do it, uh, the process that I used to do it. So let's jump into it and let's see how it works. Hey guys, before that I show you the process, let's see how the system works and I will show you how I patch everything into the desk. So, uh, on this case I've got one, two, three channel that are gonna be used for my playback, okay? And uh, my left and right is coming back just for the purpose of show you uh, how it works on 31 and 32 okay so so if I go on Reaper you will see that I've got three markers right I've got three different I mean the songs are the same but three different songs so let's say that you have got 10 songs you can create different marker one two three until 10 until 12 you can do whatever you want and what you could do you can jump to mark to mark just using the the number on the keyboard so one two, mark a two, three, mark three, or you can just change the shortcut and use maybe, I don't know, N and M to go back and forward. It's up to you. You can use whatever you want to use it without problem. So why I've done this, because when you will stop at the end of the track, you will jump to the second track and the recording will stop from the second track. So the recorder will not be continue, okay? but we'll jump to track to track because I think that that's what everyone needs. So as you can see here, I've got track left, track right. It means that I am recording the left and right going out from my desk, uh, straight from the USB. Let's see how it works. So I press number one. Let's play Command R or just record. And as you can hear, there is a uh, the track playing and in here is uh, is recording okay so you can see that it's recording the left and right coming out okay so we press stop and we say okay let's go on the second track everyone is ready your your musician we say oh yeah yeah everyone ready okay so three two one Track is recording, same things, the track will finish and we say okay let's go number three. Right, okay, let's go number three. Are we ready? Yeah, all good, ready, three, two, one. And we're recording another track. Okay. So if now I'm gonna mute this and I'm going back on my desk, okay. I'm gonna select track 31 and 32 because are the track that my left and right is going out is going in again. And I'm gonna say, okay, let's play, let's see what happens. There we go. So that's what we have recorded before from the desk. Okay? So, what I wanna show you with this, I wanna show you the fact that you can use your multi track and at the same time so you can record left and right. Uh, because as you know, with this desk, it's not possible to use the USB um, on here, on the desk, when you use the USB -B on the back of the desk. So you can record on the pen drive and at the same time you use the USB on the back of the desk for multi-track. It's not possible, I don't know if it's possible on the 1.5, but as far as I know, it's not possible yet. I'm just showing this because that can be useful for someone just to have got one cable you don't need to use any pen drive or anything you just use with the cable and you get in and out and you can record left and right from your desk so let's see together the process and uh, how this works right let's jump on my macbook and i'm gonna show you how i have root everything so as you can see i am taking the signal from my usb and this is going to my input channel. One, two, three are the three channels that I am using now for the playback. This is the input 
done. So the track that is coming from my Reaper is going into my desk. Now, we need to grab the output, okay, from our desk and we need to go on uh, our USB in. So we need to go back to Reaper. So how we do that? It's quite simple. So we're going to mix out USB and we uh, we go down in here, okay? And we need to take the mix out that is going from left and right, okay? Is going into our USB channel 31 and 32. Okay, so this is the routing done from our desk that's going from the desk to our Reaper. Okay, now let's go on a Reaper machine and let's see what I have done. So, in here, as you can see, I've got five trucks. The first three trucks are my playback. My last two trucks are record left and record right. So let's go on the patching. So what I have done in here is the following. So one, two, three channel, okay? They are going from here to the three channel of my desk. Okay? And as I'm sure I've shown you before, my 32 and 32 channel, that they are the channel for the recording, are going back on my desk on 31 and 32. So what I'm doing here, I'm sending these two channel to these two channel of my desk. And the same as I told you before, one, two, and three are going on my channel. So now what I need to do, I need to activate the two track for the recording. Okay. So I'm taking the output that is coming out from my desk, okay, and I am going in to the record left and record right of my uh, Reaper machine. So that's how is all the process done. So guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you have got any question, drop me a message uh, on the comment without no problem. Uh, if you want to see other stuff, just let me know. I'm doing, I'm trying to drop a video a week if I can. Um, I've got 20 video coming up, but the problem is that there is also other stuff. It's not just for SQ series. So I've got, as you can see on my channel, stuff for, I don't know, uh, Yamaha desk and other kind of things. So um, I'm going to try to put more stuff uh, as soon as possible. But if you've got a proper request, um, just, just let me know. Yeah, no, no problem. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.